Hello, my name's Maddie. Madison Christine. I'm 14. And, um, I would, I'm starting a vlog, video, a vlog of videos for what, um, I'm praying. Well, I don't really pray. I'm hoping that maybe I can look back on this and maybe, like, maybe I'll do one every week or every, um, couple days. But this is vlog one. It is August. I should, I'm gonna add this later into the video of what date it is, but it's pretty late right now. And all I can say is, is that I hope when I look back on my life, it was all worth it. So right now, I'm um, what I want to be, and it's gonna change consistently probably throughout all these videos. Is right now what I want to be is I wanna. Right now I wanna go to UCLA. Um, in Los Angeles, duh, and I want to graduate and become maybe a playwright or an actress. I love theater, I love everything to do with it, I just, I think it's gorgeous, I think it's a beautiful art, and and I went and saw a play with um, my school's theater group, and it was, um, it was, uh, I can't remember what it was, but it was amazing, it was, um, ghetto, that's what it was, it was ghetto, and it was amazing i wish i could remember the name of the high school that pulled it off but it was beautiful and it just made me fall in love and it makes me want to read plays and um at my old school i was going to be involved i was going to be an understudy in um the mousetrap and the mousetrap was a beautiful story very well crafted very cunning and very adorable and i thought it was amazing well like, i don't know if you should call a serious play adorable but i don't know i just i love i love all movies i love everything I love all actors and actresses. I respect them for their art. You know, everybody, like all these um, actors and actresses who make their wrong, their wrong decisions, everybody like jumps on their, like, oh, you're a celebrity, you're supposed to be our children's role model. Well, Van Gogh friggin' cut his ear off and he was doing art. So, I'm sure that a couple celebrities messing up, like, every human does isn't gonna make a big difference because I don't or maybe you don't have to respect them for who they are what decisions they make but you can respect them for the art that they um perform um my favorite actors right now actors boys are Daniel Day-Lewis and Robert Downey Jr. I wish I could think of them off the top of my head. And if you are a celebrity watching this, hi. And um, if you know a celebrity watching this that's a very well-respected actor, you could leave it in the comments if there is comments. If I put this on YouTube or you can just post something, repost this on Tumblr if I put it there. Because um, I just, one of my favorite actress is Jennifer Lawrence. I love her. And yeah about it. It's kind of sad. I wish I knew more. But oh, Scarlett Johansson, I love her. She's gorgeous and very well respected. Um, my mom wanted to be an actress. She wanted she um wanted to be a ballerina. She wanted to be an actress in New York, and she um she always had these dreams of going there. And she got that's why she got me and my sister into ballet. Was um to kind of relive her life through us, I guess you could say. And all of our family supported. They're like, oh yeah, you need to get those girls in ballet. They got long legs. And I feel bad because I never, I really wish, oh my god, if I could go back in time, I would take, I would take ballet. Like, you know, tomorrow. Because it's gorgeous. It's a, oh, it's a beautiful, beautiful. Oh, it's majestic. It's graceful. It's just something that would be great to do. And... I would I wouldn't mind going back in time to fix that because I would love doing that. Maybe even gymnastics, but I don't I think I'm too big for gymnastics. I'm five eleven. Actually five ten. Yeah, I'm five ten. Almost five eleven, pretty close. Yeah, I get taller every year. I really hope I stop growing because not a lot of guys are as tall as I am. Or taller. You have to be taller. 
But you know what? I would date a shorter guy if he was really, really cool. I'm not going to date a shorter guy if he's a jerk. But for that matter, I wouldn't date any guy if he's a jerk, so. But anyway, back on topic. I want to go to UCLA and become a theater major. Or if I find out that I'm just not a good actress, then I maybe would become a screenplay writer or write screenplays and submit them in and hope to god that someone that some studio will accept because i love writing and it would be quite a fantastic feeling to submit your writing and have it portrayed by hollywood's finest and stuff so yeah so we're moving again and this time we're moving to florida again Right now we're in Texas, in the in North North Texas, uh, outside of Lubbock. I'm not gonna say the town for obvious reasons, but really cute town. I I mean, I've made great friends here, and I hope that if y'all are watching this, we're still in touch. If we're not, I'm sorry, I'm an idiot, and so I would like to get in contact with you and all. But last time we moved, we moved from San Antonio to Florida. We stayed for a couple years, I believe it was, in an awesome town outside of Orlando. Oh my god, I love my friends there. I've got, I, all my neighbors were my friends, they were awesome. And then we're moving, and then we moved to North Texas because of my dad's job. And then those assholes screwed us over, and we were left with nothing after moving to this North Texas town. And we, um, my dad, we... We stayed at my grandparents' house, and my dad went to Florida for two weeks. We just got back, and he brought the, he took the dog to Florida, and we're moving to a town outside of Daytona, which I'm not going to say for obvious reasons, obvious reasons, and I'm very excited. I'm very excited. This high school is going to have so many opportunities. I'm going to take French, drama, um, they have, they offer dance friend if I could dance I would dance but that means that there may be some boys who take dance <laughs> oh yeah and I'm really looking forward to seeing my friends again and one of the biggest highlights of my life was me and my friend Kat I can I'm not gonna say her last name me and my best friend Kat from Florida um going to Universal Studios to watch the Avengers her it was her first time it was my second time going to see it and it was even better with her there, oh my god. It was so, we, I love the Avengers, me and my friend Kat love everything to do with Marvel and stuff. Alright, I got two minutes left. I, so we're moving to this town and I'm kind of, we have, we're gonna pack our butts off tomorrow. We have to get boxes, we have to sell, we have to sell so many things right now, we're borrowing my grandfather's truck. So yeah, um, and I'm, oh yeah, I'm 14, but I'm going to be a sophomore this year, if that makes sense. It's August, I turned 15 in January, I skipped a grade, and so that means I'm still one year away from getting car, I get my car permit. I didn't even think about that. Cool. Yeah, I get my car permit soon. I know what car I want. I want a baby blue Camaro with black racing stripes. Yeah. Oh, those are so pretty. But not for my first car because I know I'm probably not going to get one like that because that's too expensive. But probably for my first car I could deal with a broken down truck. Requires an oil change every 10 miles or so. I could deal with that. And maybe even a moped. My grandmother, my grandma has brought up the point that maybe I, if I go to a city like L.A., or Boston that I won't have it. Why would I need, we need a car? I mean, maybe to drive there, but I would never use it. So maybe a little cute little baby blue moped. I love baby blue on cars. So yeah. Well, that's all for today. Oh, I'm pretty tired. I think I'm gonna go to bed. Alright, love you.